motherfucker. Is that Donald Brashear? Hey, man, let me tell you something. Yeah, that's Donald Brashear. That's it. I'm telling you, I love hockey. Hey. Hey. hey let's be two hey, all right. let's be two older black guys that really fucking love hockey. Are you up on your hockey? I'll try. Oh Jesus. <clears throat> Man, I can't believe the LA Kings won the motherfucking hey, Stanley hey, Cup last hey, year. Hey, let me tell you something about them LA Kings, all right? That John did quick. Yeah. That John did quick. I mean, he's a hey, bad that John man. Quick, yeah. He's a bad motherfucker. You tell you tell me. Hey, there's the, a the reason that his last name is his last name. What's that for? Because he quick. John the quick is quick. Hey, he fast. You talking about a motherfucker? Hey, when goalie? he in the crease, hey, when he in the crease, when he in the crease, we ain't got nothing get past that motherfucker. The man's job hey, man, is in the protection of the crease. You see that motherfucker now. Jerome Iginla or whatever? Iginla is that his name? Miguel Guerrero. Hey, that's right. That's right. That's what I, I call saw. Him. I saw. I saw Miguel. His Miguel's mama should slap him in the mouth, hey, skating around with them white boy like that. that. That's crazy shit. I saw Miguel Guerrero. He came up. He came up. Busted through. Man, he hit. He, he, I don't want to break he away. He can't bust through no Dustin Brown, hey, man. Hey, this motherfucker broke through the defense. He broke out. He broke Which out. He line the blue line. Which he, line now? Hey, huh? Well, no, no first huh? line. No, it wasn't no first line. It was third line. Bro, I was going to say third line. Third line. Third line. So he break through the defense no on the third line. line. He break through the defense on the third line. He come up through. Man, he couldn't be. He could get past Jonathan Quick. He could get past Jonathan Quick. Let me tell you something. And the motherfucker loud got past Jonathan Quick and then play out some St. Louis Blues game done. They were singing the blues. Hey, that's man. right, man. He's doing it. They were singing the blues. He said, he said, he said, he's singing the blues. You know the backup goalie? You know what that motherfucker's name is? Huh? Bernier. Bernier? What the fuck? Hey, you can burn this. You can burn, burn this. this. You, you can know, burn we should, this. We should burn that right hey, now. Shit. Hey, shit. You know, that's Light all right. Light it up. Hey, that's I say, all right. man, that's Sutter a... don't get no credit for being a great ass coach because the motherfucker don't speak English. Hey, that's cold blooded, man. That's some cold blooded shit. Well, it's hockey. Hey, man, it's the fastest game on the motherfucking planet. Faster than Usain Bolt. Hey, man. Hey, that motherfucker. He quick. You gotta get Usain Bolt on skates. Hey, you ever seen him on skates? You ain't never seen him on skates. Hey, you ain't never seen him on skates. I love those guys. Usain Bolt on skates. I love, I love them. You're right. You're right. When you're right, you're right, motherfucker. You ain't never. How about both of us have so consciously not dropped the N word? How many times you like, man, my nigga, what the fuck you talking about? You can't have a fuck with Usain Bolt, nigga. Go on. Hey, him, huh? Him? My favorite thing to do is, huh? 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 Nick Swartz was Hey, on. man. Hey, hey, hey. Huh? <laughs> <laughs> Say what now? Who? Hey, what? Are you guys waiting to start your dream business? Because the time is now. Look, I am doing what I've always wanted to do. I'm the case in point. I am the exact person to be giving you this message, Warriors. This is my dream job. I'm doing it. I did not have LegalZoom to do it. It cost me a fortune. Check it out. LegalZoom, the official sponsor of National Start Your Business Month, wants you to get started right. Whether you're setting up an LLC, S-Corps, sole proprietorship, or even a nonprofit, that's cool. LegalZoom takes care of you from start to finish. Their award-winning service was developed by the best legal minds in the country, and every business gets personalized Attention. That's why over 90% of LegalZoom customers would recommend the service to their family. You will be in good company. I won't steer you wrong. Check this out. Over two dozen companies on the Inc. 500 lists were started through LegalZoom. That's incredible. It's National Start Your Business Month to so start your business right at LegalZoom.com. Now, LegalZoom is not a law firm, and it provides self-help services at your specific direction. But there's so much more, you guys. Now, every LLC and incorporation package includes easy-to-use business accounting software. That is a $269 value free for the More Stories podcast listeners. Be sure to enter MOHR in the referral box at checkout. Go to LegalZoom.com and enter M-O-H-R in the referral box at checkout. Start your business. Protect your family. Make a will. You can even make a will. You don't want people arguing over your belongings. Safeguard your assets at LegalZoom.com. Start your dream business. I'm telling you guys, I did. I wish I had this when I did it. I would have saved thousands. LegalZoom.com. Enter more. M-O-H-R. I put my name on it. I want you to go there, and I want you to put my name on it. Huh? Nah, man, I ain't, I ain't him. Huh? As Nick Swartzen said on this right here, famously, he says, oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> oh, okay. 
Oh, okay. I know what no first line now. Oh, that's funny. He might got through second, third line when you got a man named Martinez playing hockey. That's hey, a third line. Here's one for, here's one for you. Every every good R and B song has a has somebody saying Talking about the well well. <laughs> <laughs> well well. It's got somebody saying well well. I didn't know that. Well well. It was a sad day. Well well. When Toby went away. <laughs> Uh, let's go flame. Oh, what's your documentary? Oh, uh, it's called, uh, it's, this is a big deal for me. Uh, it's called I Know That Voice. And there's a website, I know that voice.com. There's a Facebook page. Um, I know that voice. Please like it. Please check it out. Right. Hold um, on a minute. Oh, oh, I got Jesus the Christ. St. John lacrosse team rapist trying to. Oh, yeah. You can actually else. YouTube it. Um, there's, a, we have a. Which have- way gets it? The most attention where it gets the most run where people want to put money into it and make it. Well, what helps you the most? You t- I guess you know what because like they'll the go. Facebook, the the Moriers like will go. Like the Facebook page, like the Facebook page, and go to the YouTube. There's a there's a there's two YouTube um, trailers. Facebook dot com slash. Uh, I know that voice. Okay, and and I know that voice dot com as well. I know that voice dot com, right. and it's a it's basically what it is is a documentary talking about just. Um, cartoon voiceover people like i wanted to basically i wanted to you know write a little valentine to the people i've been working with for a while now and and just show a little bit of behind the scenes what goes on because people are always asking questions so i said well why not i i'll just do it myself and you know and and talk to everybody so it was it was really great i mean we got we got just about everybody in the business clancy brown we got Clancy. Hey, man, we got Clancy Brown. Clancy Brown was in a movie with Jodie Foster now. Hey, huh? And that motherfucker was in a movie with Sean Penn. Hey, man. The original bad boys. Before them, that, the Fresh Prince motherfuckers hey, stole hey, it. Clancy Brown, that's my man right there. Clancy Brown is in the movie. Um, huh? Gray Delisle is in the movie. How um, does Angie know this? Oh, there you go. You pointed to your headset like uh, the booth just told me. Because I had the smart. <laughs> I put it in a movie. I love her. No, she's awesome. Actually, she's really wonderful. Um, uh, gosh, who else is in it? Rob Paulson, uh, Billy West, Maurice Lamarche. Is Billy West um, the richest of all these guys? Because he, write- you know what, man, Billy West is is one of the nicest, coolest guys. I didn't ask if he was nice. I asked I mean, if he was paid. I guess he's paid. Shit, oh, he's the red. He, Queen, yeah. Hey, man, he's a red. No, that's 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 the different red. No, Billy West is different. You're talking about. I'm talking about Adam West. You know, you talk Adam West. Adam West does a shit ton of voiceover too. Um, uh, I actually met. I actually met Adam West. He's all right. The, which West? <laughs> He's all right. No, you're talking about. Um, no, forget who I'm talking about. Talk who you want to talk oh, about. Okay. Um, but yeah, I mean, which Billy West are you talking about? Uh, Sorry. No, that's okay. I'm talking about Billy West. Uh, Billy, Billy West. Billy West. West who's, who, yeah. Uh, Ren and Stimpy. Ren and Stimpy. Yep. Futurama. The Red M and M. I mean, he's everything. Whoa. Whoa. Red M and M. He's been the Red M M&M and M for like fifteen years or something like that. That's ridiculous. Who do you think? What do you think Casey Kasem made? To I'm be, Casey Kasem to be Shaggy. He made. A, I were, actually worked with him. People doing don't realize. Shaggy. Casey I did a couple Kasem of. Was, I did a bunch of, of Scooby Doo's. What were you the van? Yeah, right. What were you the van? Anyway, gang. <laughs> um, fucking, no, I was actually you know like the bad guy that wasn't the main bad guy in the end. You're the guy. I never got to. Say, I never got to say if it wasn't for you meddling kids. I never got to say that, but I was other stuff. I just remember one of your guys' greatest bits when uh, shows have laugh tracks, even though there's no audience. Uh, but all, every once in a while, there's like a button that means like mayhem. <laughs> that, that like noise. when you watch the Brady Bunch. <laughs> Ready? Greg, the goat's getting away. <laughs> I haven't done that in a long time. <laughs> and, it, and you can tell. Greg, the goat's getting <laughs> away. <laughs> That's it. There it is. I think I'm warming up to it. Craig, the goat's getting away. You so got what Alice, I what's need. the butcher doing here? <laughs> um, I'm sorry. That's not good. So no, go this is great nonsense yeah, fun. This yeah, one this is super fun. Super fun. I know that voice. It's like the easiest thing. Like it's the like how has someone not made this right? That's so what a lot of people have been it. saying, man. It's 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 unbelievable. And right now we're trying to get into we're trying to get into Stop petting your hair. Why are you uncomfortable talking about this? I, is that does that mean I'm uncomfortable? You haven't touched it since you started. You did this forty times before. Really? No yeah. shit. Is that, what are you a fucking psychiatrist or some shit? I sit across this table, break a lot of things down. Yeah, you yeah, yeah you fucking 
fucking picker of scabs. He works blue, this guy. <laughs> Jesus Christ. Hey, if you want to make an Amazon purchase, go to jmore.com. Johnny's still here. This isn't, I didn't insert Yeah, ad. I'm still here. Go to amazon.com. Go to jmore.com. Oh, jmore.com. Click the Amazon banner. And click the Amazon banner. That's how we make pretty much most of the money That's the how podcast. you make that money up in here. You're going to get pregnant. I'm going to tell you something right now. Yeah. I've been doing I've been doing your impression of Tracy Morgan for years. That was Mickey Scalon. I'm telling you, Mickey Scalon. That's my motherfucking Mickey my Scalon cousin. said he's listening check to check. It's, it's universal. So I tell the people, Johnny, uh, buy something and then email me what you bought and I'll read it on the podcast and make you famous. Not Sarah Brady famous who spent like eight grand on TVs. That was a good month for us. But Brandon Thurger, Thurgar, I don't know which one Thurger. it is, right? Dear Jay, I just ordered one of those fancy water flossing machines from Amazon following your link. So you go to jmore.com, click the Amazon link, and then this guy writes, I need this damn thing. As I just flew from Australia to Bangkok for dental work, even after airfare, it's still half the price of work. For who the fuck goes to Bangkok for, for dental, dental work? work? You, go to bank, you go to Bangkok to get tits or something like that, for and Christ's sake. You don't left, go to dental he, work. Or dicks. He, or he, dicks. he, he Dr- left Dr- Australia. It's not that far. It's not that far. What the fuck? Wouldn't you just go to Sydney and find a nice dentist? Yeah. Or maybe he explains it. I found out they save a lot of money by not bothering with silly shit like anesthetic. Oh, it's Christ. It's probably the equivalent of you heading to Tijuana for a vasectomy. Anyway, I don't plan on going back, partly because of the teeth, partly because of an angry lady boy pimp. So fancy water teeth flosser for me. Hugs and shit, Brandon Thurgar. Nice job, Brandon. Congratulations, Thurgar. We all know you went to a lady boy whorehouse. Oh. Ah. I oh. sound like John DiMaggio's cat. Right oh, hello. Way. You talk. Oh, hi. I'm Hamilton. Hi, I'm Hamilton. I live with John DiMaggio. I'm a cat. Hi. It is amazing how we <laughs> make, we make noises for our animals. You, totally. I, I totally make. I totally have voices for for. Surely the Rottweiler spoke like oh. Marge Simpson. Yeah. Hey. And then uh, Mabel, the Yorkie in there, is like, you. she uh, thinks she's a boy. And she's always like, at least I don't, at least you need to seem like my big dick. <laughs> Check it out. Treasure trail. Handle it. Big dick. Nobody can fuck with it. You ever see a, a chihuahua with a big dick? Yeah. Those are the funniest fucking dogs I've. Like, when I'm jerking like, off. Oh, you never no. been to Chihuahua with a big dick dot com? Oh, really? No shit. No, we want people to go. I know that voice dot com. Yes, I, I know that voice dot com and like the Facebook page and and w- w- you know, hopefully, uh, I think we're just gonna do like a you know, like a YouTube kind. Of, not a YouTube. Uh, we're gonna release it on iTunes or something like that. Like after uh, after Fuck we have a that. premiere, get that shit in Lemley like a man. Yeah, I want to go to Buzz Coffee. And I want to go say to my wife, All we're right. going to see my friend Johnny's movie, and I want to be a big shot sitting All there right. with an armrest. Okay. Get some fucking popcorn and some milk duds. When I've always wanted to do sketches on a comedy album, like when Sandler and Fallon put out comedy albums, yeah. and I never put out a comedy album yeah. or a DVD. And I got so many that ideas, and you'd be like, just right now, like two black guys talking about just hockey. Just call me. so much fun. Just call me, Jay. Let's ad lib one and see how it goes. Really? Because okay. this is one I had for a long time. Okay. You know, famously Buzz Aldrin, right when they landed on the moon, mm-hmm. there's like 18 seconds of silence, and they thought they just got eaten by space monsters. But it's because right when they landed, Buzz Aldrin goes, so who's going out first? They did every single part of the flight plan, except for to very specifically say, Neil Armstrong, you go out first. He was the flight commander, so it was assumed. Right. But Buzz Aldrin knew the importance and the in importance of going out second yeah so he waited f- fucking a decade of planning the shit never came up and he waited till they were like dum, dum. all right so who's going out first in case neil armstrong just went like go ahead so i thought a great sketch would be because you're one of the greatest ad libbers of all time no one wants to leave and everybody makes up like ridiculous ideas of why they don't want to go out first it's... do you know what i mean yeah so we land on the moon Okay. You're going to be Neil Armstrong. And Angie, you don't have a mic. <clears throat> you be the guy whose name nobody knows, the third guy. <laughs> so I'll be Neil Armstrong. You be Buzz Aldrin. Okay. So you got to go. You, uh, you have to. Boom, boom. Okay. okay. Who's going out first? What? We're, who's going out first? We've got to go outside. It's, oh, go ahead. Go ahead. No, but, but it's all you, bro. No, but you're the, you're the leader of the mission. I'm the flight commander. I'm not well, the leader of the well, mission. Well, well, you're the exactly. You're the flight commander. You, it's supposed to be. You should be the one. Well, I don't want to go out there. Why not? I can't go out. Why you don't want you. I'm allergic you? to cats. 